guys. So, Jesse, I really liked your book review, and you set the bar a little high for me and Liz, to be honest. Um, what with your, like, love song to fantasy and the theme of good trumping evil and friendship, and I was like, well, I should read some deeper books if I'm going to be able to compete on Jesse's level. But this is, this is it. Like, obviously, I'm coming to you with my hair undone, in pajamas, in glasses, with no makeup. So, as you can probably deduce, I'm not exactly rolling in the free time. <laughs> it's like 9 o'clock in these pajamas, and I'm so old now. Um, anyway, I read Dash and Lily's Book of Dares. Um, I wanted something kind of lighthearted and YA-themed, and I'm glad I chose this book. I've obviously read the other two books written by um, the team that wrote this one, and this one is by far my favorite because it deals with the idea of um, like the expectations we have about people like in terms of love. Like, Do we build them up in our heads? Are we in love with the person we have in our head or the actual person in front of us? you know, attempting to interact with us, like, but are we clouding it with our own expectations? You know, it's kind of an interesting idea. I admit I was not too concerned with this idea when I was in high school, um, like Lily, the lead, but I think that's what I like about her is that she's exceptionally introspective, and, you know, she's just a fun character to kind of get inside of her head. Um, she also really likes boots and dogs, which endeared me to her. And her goal in the book isn't, um, I don't know, as salacious as some of the other, like, female leads. Like, she's not like, looking for the, um, she's just, <laughs> she has very wholesome goals. She just wants to have her first kiss, and I think that that's beautiful. And the book is set at Christmas, and it's just got this, like, it makes you feel, um, sort of like you're looking at Christmas lights while you're reading the book, and that's kind of what I like to feel like all the time. So it was definitely a, just a fantastic read and it was an easy read and I would recommend it. Um, Jesse, I know you tend to be suspicious of first person narratives, but perhaps Dash and Lily is for you because it rotates back and forth between Dash and Lily. So you don't kind of, um, you, get, you get to kind of switch it up. There you go, switch it up. Um, yeah, and like I said, Christmas. I mean, it's 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 a good, like, um, feel good book. And like right now, um, I'm teaching the Puritans, not really kind of the literature that brightens your day. My God, William Bradford was a boring man. So, <laughs> you know, when I come home, this is the stuff I want to read. So, um, up next, I'm not super sure what I will be reading for February, but I thought I would have something like Valentine's Day themed. So, I think this is what I'll be reading next. Someday My Prince Will Come. It's a true story. It's like a, like a memoir. So, maybe I'll get some pointers. 